All MPA Brew News. We're going to do a quick one right here. We have the Sessions ESB from South County, Pennsylvania. Is it Fawn Grove? Yeah. Fawn Grove, Pennsylvania. SouthCountyBrewing.com, I believe. Yep. Yep. County. South County. So, they are another PA Brew. I've had their Black Cowgirl and Day Rider. I really like their Day Rider as far as the Session IPA goes. Nice caramel tones to that one. I like that one quite a bit. So, English style ale, an extra special bitter. We'll just put that right there. Okay, big head on that one. A tornado. I don't know if you can see it, but this is an actual 100% tornado in a glass. Wow. Yeah, I don't know if you can actually see that. But it is. It is a cavalcade, a maelstorm of, 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 of carbonation. It's exuberant in its bubbleness. Very exuberant. So anyway, I don't know what kind of a aroma we're gonna get off this, but mm, oh, a little bit of floral, a little bit of earthiness in there. But I think you know something like that reminds me a little bit of a lemon zest. Just a little bit of caramel, toasted bread. But yeah, there's a definite perfuming kind of note out, out of that that comes with a little bit of a lemon zest. Nice. Well, let's get into this carbonated into action. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. Wow, that does taste like a really good English bitter. Oh, nice bready. Nice cereal grain breadiness on the back end, real smooth, bit of touch of drying earthiness, a little bit of that herbal note, that uh, dried leaf note. Yeah, blending in with that nice cereal grain. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of like um, Bluebird or Special XB bitter. The Conistons too. That has that drying note, that drying um, slightly copper coin note in there too. Well, wow. really easy to slam back. I don't know if they put any other information on here. 4.5 alcohol by volume. Yeah. <clears throat> nice for me the ESB an extra special bitter um, this is a really nice for just a regular you know bitter English bitter um, lingering breadiness lingering cereal grain and that cleaning there's not so much lemon there's in the taste there's a lot in the smell but uh, this is, has a little bit of age on it now so that kind of might have dialed back if it was in there but a little bit of crispness to it that I really like. And it's got a <coughs> lingering flavors. Pretty flavorful. But at the same time, super easy to drink. And a lot of carbonation in the glass, but not too much going on as you drink it. It's starting to calm down now. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yeah. I don't think it's bottle conditioner or anything. But, wow, that is a tornado when it gets in there. This goes to town. Very simple to drink, very easy, very tasty. Definitely a 7.5. It's, it's, it's not going to blow your doors off or anything like that, but super solid, very, very tasty. Give it a go. Let me know what you think. It's from Paul from PA Brunos. Cheers. Mm. Mm. That won't last long. <laughs> 